Hello, my name is William Johnson, and this is going to be my uh, egg spin inertia lab thing. All right, here I got a hard boiled egg, and here's a raw egg. And what I'm going to do is spin them, and then stop them, and then I'm going to let go and see what happens. All right, we got the raw egg here, and we're going to spin it. As you can see, it stops spinning once I stop it. As for the raw egg, it stopped for a moment and then it keeps spinning. The reason for this, I believe, is through the laws of inertia. And what inertia means is when something is in motion, it stays in motion unless something stops it through friction. As with the hard boiled egg, once more, I'll spin it and it's going to keep going until I stop it with my hand. And the raw egg, as I spin it once more, well, that was a bad spin. I'll spin it, stop it, and it continues spinning. The reason for this is the hard boiled egg. Where it's been boiled up, the yolk has been solidified. So basically, that makes it almost one solid object. So once I put my hand on it, the whole solid thing all the way to the core makes it stop. The raw egg has a liquid yolk inside. While I stop the solid, the yolk has continued to spin inside. So once it stops, or the yolk is spinning, it makes the whole egg spin as well. It'd be almost the same as if you put your hand and your finger in a pot of water and swirl it around. And once you stop, the water will keep swirling, but of course the pot's not going to swirl it itself. Well, never mind, I kind of contradicted myself there. Uh, anyway, moving on. <laughs> um, things I learned about that is inertia just keeps going. And that's basically the law, it just keeps going unless something stops it. If you shoot a bullet through a gun, the bullet will keep going as long as we didn't have air pressure or anything it hits. It would just keep going forever. That's why you see things in space going on forever. But anyway, this is my egg experiment. I could be rambling on with all kinds of examples, but uh, this is what I have for you today. And thank you for watching.